Awesome job, team. We'll wrap up our shout-outs with that one so we can get going on to what we need to do today. We're going to cover some stats. I was very, very excited um, about Nerf War, and I'm going to tell you why, because I think we just unlocked something as a team. Over the last couple of weeks, we've had a couple of reports from people who can't ring up sales. So my point is this. The things that hold us back are simply us not having systems in place. All right, so... We finished training, we got here at a little bit before 8, so we walked in the door around 7.45 and 7.50ish we were getting ready and then 8 o'clock we started working out with the O2 trainer. So it was a light workout, but it was a really hard workout and uh, with the O2 trainer is not merciful at all. So what did you feel? The O2 trainer! <laughs> He's not the O2 trainer, the blue thing is the O2 trainer. I'm the oh. oh no trainer. <laughs> so it worked out with that, which is really good because that's gonna help with our cardio and put our cardio on another level. So I'm 12 weeks out. She's coming to help me while school is still out. And then when school is back in session, we were given the option of 5 a.m. workouts. I'll, I'll think about we'll think about that. <laughs> <laughs> now they're coming out the end of October, beginning of November. Whatever one that you're doing, you need to be preparing for it. Hey. First thing that I want to know is like how many beginner BJJ people we currently have in the school. The way to find that out would be going through Spark and then uh, anybody who holds a Machado rank of only white belt. I'm also going to find out what's the minimum that they have in Spark so we can switch it up. Right, because we, okay. we're going to have to, this is going to have to be a program that people are enrolling for. What's the due date on all of this? Until when do we have? Can you find it out by the end of this week? Yes. Or is there too much stuff going on? Uh, well, the, the biggest thing for me it's right now is the schedule. So by the end of this week, mm -hmm. Friday, it'll be great. Go team! <laughs> Wrapping up. I haven't done too many recaps this week. It's busy. Yeah, no. no. We've been busy. We had, this has been a busy, crazy week. Been catching up since coming back from vacation. There's been a lot of a lot of things and it's just getting busier and busier because our busiest time of the year is at back to school. So we're a few weeks out from back to school. So it's like 
making sure that all the I's are dotted and the T's are crossed. And so there's been a lot of that going on lately. Because of all these videos and going out and all that kind of stuff, we're actually going to be uh, going on WRDW News Channel 12, and I'm going to be doing an interview, so that's coming up tomorrow. So I'm excited. It's going to be a great day tomorrow, and then Saturday's training day. So I officially started first week of fight camp, so that was pretty cool as well. That's going to be our wrap-up, because my little kid's coming in right now. Hi. 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 I'm riding a roller coaster in Minecraft. <laughs> Are these all this close? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know who packed those. I guess I guess Titus packed them. I don't know. Oh, oh, no, those weren't supposed to be for today. <laughs> oh, boy. Hi, Jacob. Hi. Hi. Hi, Beckett. What's up? Hello. Yeah. See you guys later. Bye. Bye. Bye, Bye <laughs> When did you kind of realize this was going to be something you're going to do for a long time? You know, I think when kids are all trying to figure out in high school what they're going to do with their life, and you know, there's so much pressure. Oh, you're going to go to this college. You're going to be a doctor. You're going to be a lawyer. You're going to be whatever. And I'm like. I'm going to run a martial arts school, and I'm going to be a fighter, and everybody's like, what? And I want to compete. I want to test myself on a national, a, you know, a, a world-type level. It's what we do with what God's given us that really allows us to be able to succeed or to fail. Um, they can always go find me on YouTube as well and watch some of the resources that I have, some of the day-to-day, -day, you know, I blog. So that's a great way for people to see, okay, what is it like? What's the atmosphere like? Hey vlog, uh, we just wrapped up shooting an interview for a local news station here, WRDW News Channel 12. Pretty cool because all of this is working. You guys are paying attention. Uh, you want to know more information about me and I'm honored. Thank you guys so much. People are starting to talk about uh, what's happening and want to know more information about the fights, about the business, about my life in general. So I'm honored for that guys. Maybe we can link it up um, in this vlog in the comments and you can go watch the interview. But as always, it was a great day. I got in like a little mini workout because he had to get some shots of me working out. So, yeah, I'm going to go change in a little bit and uh, see y'all soon. Hey guys, so we're getting ready to start training. This is the first week of fight camp, first Saturday of fight camp. I sent out messages to some of my training partner friends that are up in Simpsonville, South Carolina, waiting back on answers from them, setting up some days to go up to Upstate Karate, where my friend Stephen Thompson trains uh, welterweight in the UFC. So getting all that prepped and ready, this is a big, big fight, and I can't wait to do all this training and come back with that belt. Hands are up, throw the jab first. Hey, throw the cross. Hey, throw the hook.
Hey guys, we just uh, wrapped up Saturday and that was probably one of the best ways to wrap it up. Uh, student of ours, Micah, was coming in doing some private lessons, working on his sparring, working on his punches and kicks. And uh, I came in and he said, oh, I see your videos all the time um, and is a fan. And so I said, well, you want to be in one of my videos? And he goes, ah, that would be awesome. So we got him out here, got a couple of uh, sparring round in, got some mitt work in. So he was happy. He had a great, a great time. So. That's going to be wrapping it up for Saturday for Waterworks. Check back in with you guys soon.